Have you ever been amazed by CJ Stroud's quick rise in football? This video is all about his exciting journey. Before we dive into the exhilarating saga, do me a favor and smash that subscribe button. Are you a fan of witnessing football legends in the making? Show your excitement with a big thumbs up. Ready to embark on the journey? Let's delve into the captivating story of CJ Stroud's rise to stardom. Let's roll! C.J. Stroud, the unstoppable quarterback force, started his journey in the sunny city of Rancho Cucamonga, California. Born on October 3, 2001, C.J. was the youngest of four siblings. Growing up in a family that faced more than its fair share of challenges, his dad, Coleridge Bernard Stroud III, faced a tough sentence in 2016, leaving the Stroud family in a tough spot financially. But let's talk about CJ's passion for football. It was like a shining star in the darkest night. At Rancho Cucamonga High School, CJ wasn't just playing football, he was making football history. As a senior, he lit up the field and grabbed the headlines as the Inland Valley Daily Bulletin's Offensive Player of the Year. In 2019, he was the MVP of the Elite 11, where the top high school quarterbacks battle it out. Plus, he shone brightly in the 2020 All-American Bowl, showcasing his skills on a national stage. Starting as a three-star recruit, CJ's journey was like a rocket ship, blasting off to become the third highest rated quarterback in his class. His next chapter, Ohio State University, where he didn't just play football, he set the field on fire with record-breaking performances in a trophy case full of accolades. CJ's Kala Saga at Ohio State was nothing short of a sports movie. Joining the Buckeyes in 2020, he started as a redshirt freshman, learning the ropes and waiting for his moment. And oh, did that moment come! He scored a thrilling 48-yard rushing touchdown against Michigan State, a play that had fans on their feet. 2021 was the year C.J. Stroud became a household name. Stepping up as the starting quarterback after Justin Fields headed to the NFL, Stroud showed the world what he was made of. His skills? Top-notch. Leadership? Unmatched. Accuracy? Like a sniper. And get this, he was a finalist for the Davey O'Brien Award and the Heisman Trophy. That's like being in the running for the crown jewels of college football. But just when everyone thought this guy was done, C.J. Stroud threw five touchdowns against a Big Ten rival not once, not twice, but four times in a single season. That's right, he's the only quarterback in Ohio State history with that feather in his cap. The 2021 season saw the Buckeyes charge to a 10-2 record under Stroud's command. Sure, there were bumps in the road with losses to Oregon and Michigan, but champions rise, right? And rise they did in the Rose Bowl. Zooming into 2022, Stroud was the man to watch in college football, a frontrunner for the Heisman Trophy. On October 8th, against Michigan State, he was like a quarterback wizard throwing six touchdown passes and setting a conference record. Though the Buckeyes stumbled against Michigan, they still made it to the college football playoff. In the Peach Bowl semifinal against Georgia, Stroud was a force of nature, throwing for 348 yards and four touchdowns. It was a heartbreaker, though, as Ohio State narrowly missed victory, 42-41, but Stroud's star power shone bright throughout the season, earning him another nod as a Heisman Trophy finalist, where he finished an impressive third. After two seasons that felt like a whirlwind of touchdowns and record-breaking plays, Stroud made a bold move. He decided to say goodbye to his college days and say hello to the big leagues. Entering the 2023 NFL Draft, blasting off his NFL career, C.J. Stroud, snagged by the Houston Texans as the second overall pick in the 2023 NFL Draft, became the highest-drafted quarterback from Ohio State ever. Talk about setting the bar high! Before we dive deeper into the incredible NFL kickoff was a spectacle to behold. On September 10, 2023, against the Baltimore Ravens, he launched 242 yards through the air. Sure, the Texans didn't clinch the win, but Stroud was just warming up. Come week two, facing the Indianapolis Colts, he lit up the scoreboard with his first two NFL touchdowns and a jaw-dropping 384 passing yards. That's the kind of stuff that gets you into the record books. But wait, there's more. By week three, Stroud had joined the elite club of Cam Newton and Justin Herbert, being one of the only players to rack up over 900 passing yards in their first three games. And oh boy, did he keep the momentum going, earning the NFL Offensive Rookie of the Month title for his September shenanigans. Week five brought another record-smashing moment. Stroud threw his 177th pass without a single interception cruising past Dak Prescott's previous record. 
This streak of sheer brilliance stretched to 191 attempts before coming to a halt. Even after a tough concussion in Week 14, Stroud bounced back like a champ. In a crucial game against the Tennessee Titans, he was a passing maestro, securing the Texans' first playoff spot since 2019. Then, in a nail-biting match against the Colts, he joined the Legends, becoming one of only five quarterbacks to throw over 4,000 yards in their rookie season. Not just that, he led the league in passing yards per game and touchdown-slash-interception ratio, a feat that legends like Tom Brady and Joe Montana had achieved. Talk about being in good company! But the real magic happened in his playoff debut against the Cleveland Browns. Stroud wasn't just playing, he was rewriting the playbook. TJ Stroud's rookie season was like a highlight reel that you can't stop watching. From a college hero to an NFL record breaker, his journey has been nothing short of spectacular. And that's the clock running out on today's episode. We've just completed a thrilling journey through the meteoric rise of CJ Stroud, a tale of grit, talent, and unstoppable ambition. Now it's your turn, our fantastic audience. I'm eager to hear your thoughts. What do you think about CJ Stroud's rapid ascent in the world of football? How significant do you believe his journey has been in shaping the future of the sport? A huge shout out to everyone who joined us. I hope this exploration into CJ Stroud's remarkable journey was as riveting for you as it was for me. This isn't farewell, but a catch you later. I'll be back soon with more gripping stories from the football field. So stay tuned for our next episode and keep that football fervor burning.